seven minutes until the aerial bombing of Undisclosed. John said, Now nah, fuck that bullshit. Everybody in the truck, we're heading out. Marconi said, So we ride to safety while the tens of thousands who remain in the city behind us burn? And then what? We drive out across the buffer zone outside those barricades, and a few miles later you will meet another larger barricade manned by the U.S. military. Martyrdom isn't something you choose. It is thrust upon you. Amy said, Oh, wait! Oh my god, it's so simple! We just, okay, we just have to get to an open area between us and the plane, so he sees it. The cornfield. Everybody get to the cornfield! To John, she said, Get on the, uh, the speaker fan in the truck. Tell everybody to go to the cornfield. We didn't need to tell anybody anything. Hundreds of people were flowing past us through the ruined barricades, the city draining out through the highway like water. We piled into the truck, managed to get it turned around without running over a dozen people, and rumbled off toward the cornfield. On the way, Amy said, The plane! Oh god, I can't believe I didn't think of this! It's flying low, under the clouds! We can see it, so it can see us! I don't understand how that... The pilot thinks we're zombies! We just have to show them we're not!